It's Wednesday, 5th September, and this is Top Stories by Rooster News. The final day of oral submissions in the extradition hearing of Vijay Malia in London took a dramatic twist as the businessman revealed that he had met Finance Minister Arun Jetley in Parliament before he left the country in March 2016. Alongside reiterating his offer to settle with banks, he also mentioned to Mr. Jetley that he would be leaving for London, he said. I met Mr. Jetley in Parliament and told him I was going to London, period, Mr. Malia said just outside the courtroom as the hearing concluded yesterday afternoon. However, he insisted that the issue was being turned into a controversy by quote-unquote my friends in the media. Earlier in a statement, Mr. Jetley said, I have never given him any appointment to meet me and the question of his having met me does not arise. However, since he was a member of the Rajya Sabha and he occasionally attended the house, he misused that privilege on one occasion while I was walking out of the house to go to my room. He paced up to catch up with me and while walking uttered a sentence that I am making an offer of settlement. The UN began work yesterday inside Myanmar's violent stone northern Rakhine state the first time its agencies have been granted permission to operate there since more than 7 lakh Rohingya Muslims fled last year. The UN has been waiting for access to the epicentre of the military's clearance operations against the Rohingya minority since June when its refugee and development agencies signed a deal with the government. The task is complicated further as the UN's rights arm is expected to heavily censor Myanmar again in the coming days when it publishes in full the findings of its investigation into the atrocities against the Rohingya. Three persons were killed and five others were injured when a parcel containing firecrackers that were unloaded from a vehicle exploded at Pillayar Street in Shasti Nagar in Erod yesterday. The accident occurred at 6.30 a.m when a seller who had procured the crackers for Deepavali was unloading the crackers from a minivan. The police said that one of the cracker bundles exploded and the fire spread to other bundles. In the impact, the vehicle and five houses were completely damaged. The extent of the damage is being assessed, they added. The police are yet to confirm the identity of the three dead. The injured, who are both workers and residents, were admitted to the district headquarters hospital. We round up this newscast with fuel prices from key metros. In Delhi, petrol is sold for 79.40 rupees per litre and diesel for 71.43 rupees per litre. In Chennai, petrol is sold for 82.51 rupees per litre and diesel for 75.48 rupees per litre. In Kolkata, petrol is sold for 82.31 rupees per litre and diesel for 74.27 rupees per litre. In Mumbai, petrol is sold for 86.80 rupees per litre and diesel for 75.82 rupees per litre.